Welcome to Fridge Art, where the Dunning Kruger effect is exploited. <laughs> I thought of that earlier. Um, well, there you go. <laughs> my name is Andrea Radek. And I'm Kristen Plesko. And, uh, yeah, so what are we feeling today? What are we feeling? What's, what type of crap are you, are you willing to look at today? Ah, uh, well, I have a special one today. Uh, it was a, it was a class project. It was a still life from, uh, Is this the one you said that you just didn't do the foot? No. Oh. No, this is not. There are no feet involved in this. It is a, uh, it is a painting of a statue, and it is fun. Oh, my okay. ringtone. Let me, uh... I'm like, who left the Age of Empires Dad sent me an email. Give me a call. Or give us a call. Let me... Oh, we're... Yeah, no, we're recording. I'll, uh... Just text him and say you can do it in, like, an hour. Uh... Yeah. Uh, doing something super important. Please call back in an hour. Call uh, call you in an hour. An hour. Yep, I typed you literally. Because we're terrible. That person. I know. Now, but what type of crap do you want to see from me? Like, give me oh. a, a theme. Uh, practice something. Pra- some... It's not fun. To... What do you mean practice? Do you have any like still lives or something like that? We already looked at those. Last time. The naked people? Oh, yeah. Okay. Um. Er. I think that might actually have been the time before. Oh, God. How about, how about a furry? One of your first furries. That would oh. be good. I didn't start doing that stuff till a lot more recently. Oh. Well, uh, that's no me, fun. Let me see. Okay. okay. I'm going to turn and look at my coffee so I don't Look see. at your coffee. I'm going to go into the... I can just hear, like... Uh, what? Something furry. Mm-hmm. Some sort of furry commission? Some sort of furry or, like, animal or something. I okay. think that'd be fun. What? Oh. Hmm. Alright, that might be that one. Take it back. I have plenty of furry ones in here. <laughs> uh. Of course you do. That one might get a little controversial. No, uh, well, it's fine. Yeah, you say that. You haven't seen it. Nope. Okay. I guess we're going with this one. Hold on. Alright, turn back. Oh man! Oh god! So this is a commission. Um, so uh, if that person is listening. I have no ill will towards your character. Just my interpretation of your character. Um, gosh! Oh, this was done in like two thousand eight ish. Yeah, this is this yeah, was. This is I would actually say this might have been two thousand ten, if not really more recent than that. I keep forgetting that you you like started drawing only like recently. So I always get my years wrong. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, so this is a Fennec Fox. Um, I can tell. Believes in the devil and Jesus Christ. <laughs> yeah, I noticed he has a uh, <laughs> look. His star- like really <laughs> human fingers. I so, like his. I like his. Uh, oh God, the shading wah! is like. I so like the black uh, shading. Yeah, yeah. This was still Ooh. in that sort of era. So, like, this was this was early on. So if it was a furry thing, then, yeah, it must have been either 2010 or 2011. Really? Jesus. Yeah. Um, I could look real quick, but I'll maybe do that in a bit. Uh, So I was not really comfortable drawing people or (laughs) (laughs) anthropomorphized. None of the above. What were you comfortable with? This might have been my first Fennec that I ever drew. Yeah, I like it. I like its, uh, its anime eyes. Yeah. And then, like, the whites of the eyes are just kind of like a light blue for some reason. <laughs> if they're very flat. Everything on this is super flat. I like how the lines just are, like, really defined on the mouth and stuff and the eyes, but nothing else has lines. I may like drawing angry mouths and, and teeth and stuff. Not in, like, a vor way. Or it just... Oh, it could be in a vor way. Oh, and I've done those commissions in the past, but, <laughs> uh, yeah, I just... I didn't really, like, I'm like, oh, Fennex are adorable, and I started drawing it, and his head was just, like, really round and bulbous. Like, regular Fennex are. They're just, they come like a circle, and then these BFE, big fucking ears, like, sticking out the top. Um, so, like, I fiddled around with this a lot, and, like, he has sort of, like, banana nose syndrome, except it's going away from us. (laughs) It's, I like how even the palms of the hands don't have, like, pads or anything, so they just have fur everywhere, and it's like, imagine, like... It's just how like hot it would be. Imagine how miserable you'd be like, oh god, I'm a monster. And I, like I have all, you know, I don't, there's no way to I, like. I, I do like how his hand is just like, it looks like a, like a hairy ass. 
It looks like basically, yeah. <laughs> it looks like kind of like a scrotum or like a peach or something. Like just not. Look at how his look at his thumb. Look at his fucking thumb. It's like a. It reminds me of like um, like a funnel cake. And it looks like sort of like, like a hollow. Like I'm looking at my lighting and my. It, that's not what. That's not how it works. There no. is like there is like a flesh from the knuckle to like. It the, just uh, it looks hollow. The thumb looks hollow. Or it just looks like it's a uh, flat. Like really flat, like it doesn't attach. Like like it doesn't have that flap. Oh yeah, it here. doesn't yeah. look like it actually attaches. To me, to it the looks hand. like someone took a took a spoon and scooped out part of the <laughs> you know scooped out part of the thumb. Like how about like it's just like it's I'm I'm doing the motion in IRL. Uh, I obviously missed like this sort of this drastically. You mean the, this joint the, just does not exist? It's just like it's like a little tentacle nub, just attached to his his. See, I can't even do hairy that. My, mine can't even do that. I think I'm uh, you, have a, a, you have a hitchhiker's thumb. Is that what that is? Yeah, yeah. See, I I, I mean, can't. I literally yeah. can't go any further. I don't have. I none of my thumbs can do it. I just that is I as just, far as they can go. <laughs> we're learning things. Yeah, we're every we're, day. we're looking my, at our thumbs. Mine is literally completely. Kristen straight. Kristen has a completely straight thumb, and then my thumb like it, it goes has up. a nice curve to it. It, co- it cocks back quite a bit. Yeah, mine just. Yeah, I have to like. Actually, no. Look at the difference with. You can have it in different on different thumbs. Oh, like this one's not nearly as bad. This one is just yeah, all the way the is... fuck out there. I haven't really. Do you think it's like a drawing thing? It's on my on my main drawing hand. No, because well, like this one. No, it's just genetics. <sighs> no, look, look at my thumbs. Can you tell which one I draw with? No, Killed because they're both the same. These <laughs> thumbs, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, no. Oh god, that other thumb is really. Mm. Really short too. Yeah. It's like a. It's literally like a nipple of a thumb, and it's just. It's just like. <laughs> Uh, oh, it, it's just, thumb. I'll be honest, the colors really gross me out. Yeah. Like, it just, awful. to me, it just, like, I just... I, it looks like it's in a really like bad, blue, like, photography studio. Yeah, it, it reminds me of Windows 95. Like, it just is it's like that... It's not as bright as Windows 95. It isn't. It's also not as gray and dingy and unhappy. But yeah. it's, I think it's the combination of the, like, off-white of the Phoenix fur plus blue reminds me of, like, a, those old 90s computers. Yeah, it it, it has it's very little trapped. life onto it. <laughs> Aw. <laughs> So, this is one of the commissions where, like, the characters a lot of very symbolic ear piercings and stuff. Mm-hmm. And I like how, if you look at these ear piercings up here, like, they, they just look like they're sort of laid on top of the ear. They don't actually look like they're going through it at all. And it's yeah. probably because this one here just has, like, no distance. I'll be honest, whenever I get a character with big ears, that is, like, my secret fear, is, like, having to draw specific ear piercings in them. Yeah. Like, I just... I don't know, maybe it's like... I remember I, this I, one coming back to me that, like, I had to... Like, I, I screwed up something with the earrings to start, and then I had to fix them. Did you accidentally make the cross upside down? <laughs> Kit Romney, the hell? You gotta stop that. Come here. Kit Romney is sporting his, his fancy lion's cut. Yeah. yeah. His little, little butt was shaved. <laughs> he gets a lot of mats and stuff, so he needs it. Uh, how about up the neck? Look at how thick it's the neck gross. is. Look at how thick that neck I, is. No, I I see it. It Look is at like just this area here. It is where to me, it just like, looks what's like, happening with the collarbone? Like I think it's just a flat. Line. It's actually like sticking out. <laughs> looks like. Oh, God, it. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I just like oh, God. I you know if if this was if I was giving a critique, I would ask you to flip it. I don't even know if Windows you could do that. Can you? Um, you can rotate it, but what a stupid thing to do. I uh, well, I'm just need to rotate my uh, image. I can bring up Photoshop real quick. Cause like, cause I'm sure something else will come up if you if you rotate All right, it. We'll flip it. Go into the shit folder. You can't. You can't just drag it in there. Or is that not how Windows works? Uh, I'm a, I'm a dirty know. Mac there user, so. You know. Oh yeah, it also has this like white bar. I did this thing for a while. Where, ah. like, I tried to frame it in an interesting ah, way, and I'd seen terrible. someone that did it, I think I was supposed to do it like a, like a print, like it's supposed to look like a print, but yeah, I just, like, put a bunch of white on the I top and the bottom. That. Cause I did that a lot. <laughs> I don't know why. You know I what I do? I go to photo, I go right, to edit, and then, or image, and then trim, and then say white, so then it would take away those stupid white bars. <laughs> You're cruel. I am cruel. Okay, so here's it flipped. Oh, God, it's even flatter that way. Yeah, it, it, it definitely uh, seems like the, the fate, like, yeah, it, it lacks a lot of like, appropriate definition. So, like, over over here, for some reason, like, this is supposed to be your jawbone, which should be a lot farther back, and then for some reason, 
there's a lot of light just on the other side of it. So that would indicate that it had like, like the a job fat bag. Bone. Yeah, but yeah, it would like have like a big tumor on the side of his face. He's like a he has a fat sticking jaw. Well, like fatty jaw. He has a. If I were to go through this now, I would make this all shadow. If this is coming from this side, all fucking shadow on that side. Yeah, there's no point for. You can have some rim lighting, or like. And I some, did. Some bounce oh, light. There? That doesn't fucking. Oh happen. my god! Look at his shoulder. Uh, <laughs> it looks like a furry dick. Like, Good. just, no, well, no, I mean, if you look at it, like, the stem of the dick or whatever is, like, I don't know what you call it. It's the, the shaft, stamen. The, the shaft I, and the... I guess, yeah. And then the the, the bulbous stem. head is the shoulder, is the actual, like, that part of the shoulder. I don't know, that's what it looks like. It what looks like a mushroom or something. So, wait, this would be the head? Well, to me, it just looks like a, like a Jesus thick, Christ. thick furry penis. Like, that's what it looks like to me, but maybe I just have furry penises on the brain. It doesn't make any sense. <laughs> it doesn't make any sense, but um, uh, yeah. Hi, I'm Kristen. <laughs> I got thick furry pieces right on the brain. Take it out of context, please. So, uh, <laughs> so why is the background flat? Why would I what think this was your was, choice? I think this was a commission where it didn't have a background. So I just went with literally the flattest goddamn oh, background. God, that is the worst blue. Like it's just. Yeah, your, your screens are also a little hard to see because I guess they're a little dim. But no, they're they're bright in the middle. Like this would actually, if you like, oh, lower down. Oh, because I'm over here because they're not ISP or IPS. I'm working on it. Oh, okay. oh it's a little better? brighter now. Yeah, yeah. No, it was significantly darker from the side. It looks really blue on this one. Yeah, like do you have two different monitors? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> This was my original mount monitor when I first got a desktop, and this is a more recent uh, monitor, which I don't know which one is worse, because they're both not good. Uh, get, a, get one of those Dell monitors. They're pretty good. They're expensive, though. They're like I want to get the, the ultra-wide ISP. How would you pay for that, though? You can literally it's fucking just... rad. It is rad. Um, I'm not denying the <laughs> radicalness of that monitor. It's rad but it is also a thousand. It's also a thousand dollars. Raditude. The yeah, I'm waiting for them to come down to price a bit. They obviously. Won't. Oh, okay. Yeah, it won't. <laughs> <laughs> they it will. Can. It'll be fine. You better uh, have to wait like two years, so you might as well buy something in the meantime. Yeah, it's some sort of ISP monitor. Is Dell has really good ones that are 27 inches. That's not too bad. By the way, Dell has. Well, except this this fridge art brought to you by Dell. Yeah, brought to you by, by Dell. ISP Please monitor. don't buy their desktop computers because they're bad. But <gasps> they're not that bad. Are you sure? I honestly haven't had one in a while, so. Uh, I. Is he eating something? I don't know. Hey! Fuck you doing? Come here! What the fuck are you eating? You eating a bug? Fuck ever. Um. So you saw. I saw that you had answered that one question. I was gonna answer it on mic. That's why I didn't put an answer to it. Oh! The one question the guy asked, like, we can go to that real quick. So maybe we can explain. Oh, I'm answers. sorry. I, I just saw that there are things, and I was like, <laughs> someone was at, I think someone asked me about my last name, so I figured it was easy. Just well, to type yeah, it. that one is. Yeah, that one was easy. <laughs> was like, oh, are you Polish? Nope. <laughs> nope. But I thought it was fun how the last the people who who chose my last name were so lazy that I could literally just pinpoint the town they were from right, just based on the name. Oh, oh, <laughs> started playing. Oh, hopefully they didn't pop up. Uh, uh so the the question. That Mauricio DeCaro, colon Rusty, or not colon, parentheses Rusty, asked, was uh, a little question, tell you about it, asked Kristen as well. There's a poor man sitting in the sidewalk, I assume on the sidewalk, asking for coins, and with time, two guys walk past him, and two of them are giving the man a couple of dollars. One of them is a very caring person that gives a couple dollars to him without hesitating, while the other guy is very stingy and greedy, and he gives to the man after a couple, a couple dollars. Anyways, the question is, which... Which of them is the kindest and bravest at giving a couple of dollars to the poor, poor man? The very caring one or the very greedy one? And do you want to explain your answer? Oh, yeah. Well, basically, I put, like, you know, the knee-jerk reaction is, of course, you know, the one that, you know, was painting the positive light. The one who was described as a caring, gentle person who would give money regardless of how much they had. Mm. It didn't say they were poor. It just said that they were caring. And, it, and I say that, honestly, like, you know, when you really think about it, it's probably harder for someone who's stingy to give up that money and I would I would respect them more and encourage them to do it more versus just like 
bitch at them because they're stingy and they gave away two dollars uh, even though the other I, I don't know like to me it you know i respect i honestly i don't know like could they could they buy the poor man a sandwich like you know <laughs> like what if what if you know like like that that's my that's my thing like like how is this out person? of context my answer is don't give him any money <laughs> yeah out of context i would give him don't a give sandwich homeless people yeah give him a I, sandwich. I do not i do not believe in giving panhandlers money because no. there are a lot of people there are a lot of very attractive panhandlers that get yeah. out of their car and then they they're they, nice bmw they by around. the way yeah it was a nice bmw yeah. and they nicer bum car around, than we have bum around roanoke yeah and and richmond was full of them i also saw people smoking crack so Hooray. yeah it's the Virginia spoon one what's like the a, spoon spoon one is uh, that crack spoon drug Spoon drug. Yeah, they were doing spoon drug outside of school, <laughs> and also there was a man selling a, what I Did assumed you tell me to that be those, They were up to no good and started making trouble in the neighborhood. They didn't make trouble. They were just sitting there smoking <laughs> yeah, you know, spoon one drugs. <laughs> As you can uh, tell, I didn't partake in any drugs. No spoon, spoon drugs. No spoon drugs. No, no butters no bulbs or drugs. bulbs or what do you smoke the pot in? <laughs> like, you sound like my grandmother. Bulbs, like, are you smoking the, the pot types? There we go. Smoke pipes, crack pipes. Like, bowls, what do you call them? Bowls. Bowls. Bowl. Is that what you call them? So, I, can't, I don't fucking know. I'm allergic to it. I can't. I'll see. I just don't like don't the smell. Uh, my answer for that question was neither of them are better. <laughs> uh, there you go. They both. Uh, I'm just gonna read straight off because I can't think. They both had the same result and both overcame their hang-ups either early on with the caring person or with time with the greedy person. Perceptively, they both did the exact same thing, just with slight variation to their approach. There's not yeah. one person that's more brave and more honest I don't than even know what's other. brave about it. Was he going to get stabbed if he didn't well, get it? Well, I, I think like... that Marcio De Caro uh, may be from a different country and stuff, so I think oh, some okay. of the word choices are, are differently, so I don't... Oh, okay. I think he was just going for honorable and oh, okay. like, respectable. Uh, I would assume. I would assume they were both naive for giving this person money and well, giving them a yeah, sandwich. Well, yeah, but... I mean, and it sounds like I'm a bad person, and trust me, like, I've gone... You know, there are a lot of poor, you know... Don't help people. No, like, like I gave <laughs> I gave a homeless man, like, I, you know, I, I was walking home from school, and then I, I went back to my apartment, got, like, a cup of water, and came back out, because it was really hot that day, but he was... He was, uh... Unable to thank me for various reasons. I think he had some, some was things. Was he a bit inebriated... Uh, no, I think he was just, uh, he had some things going on in his mind that didn't allow him to speak on the same planes of reality that we all do. Did he take your water? Yeah, he did. But he, he, he didn't say anything. No, he didn't say anything. And I guess that weirds me out when someone, you can't, like, talk to someone. And, like, maybe that's why I'm just uncomfortable around people like like that. I don't know. Like. Yeah, I don't know. Just as a person. I don't. I don't give money to panhandlers for a lot of the reason. Like, I've I've tried to give sandwiches and muffins before, and then they tell me to get that weak shit out of their face, and they don't want it. Like, Yeah, because they want money, because they're panhandlers a lot of the time. They, they want money. Yeah, money Dollar for bills. various recreational activities. Yeah. Anyways, but yeah, my, my thing is that, like, they both eventually sort of came to the same conclusion, so there's not really one more honorable than the other. Yeah. I don't really understand enough. the question. Like, uh, I, I understand it, but I just... I don't get it. Well, like, also, like, like is it a bad to, thing? Like, I feel like a very, like, cold well, person just saying, nobody deserves any sort of honorable praise. Well, plus, like, Both well, the problem is, like, you know, I guess we don't know the background of the situation. Like, is this person, like, you know... I think it's a thought exercise. Well, I mean, but the thing is, though, is, like... it's a thought like, exercise on perception of uh, what is good and what is bad. Oh. Everything is gray. Nothing yeah. is good, nothing is bad. That's what I mean. Everyone so I came dies. to neither. There we go. <laughs> so Everyone about. is mortal. <laughs> uh, yeah, so if okay. you guys want to ask us a question and stuff, we are well willing and able to answer them for you. It's a it, it's a bit of a decide. Let's go back to our, our wacky fun. Sorry. Man. Ask us what we do if we go back in time. There you go. <laughs> yeah, we talked about that one. Uh, yeah, the coloring on this is gross. Yeah, like, it's, uh, it's, I think I remember being really proud of the uh, shirt. And it's like a, a knotted up shirt thing. To me, it looks like a wisp of smoke, and I'm kind of grossed out by the colors on it. <laughs> I, I think it was supposed to be, like, like sort of, like, a lighter color than that, but yeah, it looks like a wet t-shirt contest thing. And it's also it sort of like cupping... It's wet material. Well, it's like, it's cupping around something that there's nothing there. Yeah. I don't understand what it is. Actually, I don't either. What the hell did I... <laughs> Where's everything? I don't know. Just... His just... hand is also, like, really, like... 
Like if you look on that other one, the 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 one that's flipped, you can really see it. That the hand Which on one? the hand the, that you the can flared see, out hand, the flared or the, out hand, the, the ball sack hand, the the flared out hand. Okay. Like it's really curved one way. Yeah. I don't think that's how hands do. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> my hands don't do. Well, your hands are all fucked up, apparently. What? My hands are what? Fu- my hands aren't fucked up. You that's can go normal. back to the thumb example, but no, it's just it's nope. a trait. It's just a trait. It doesn't mean your hand is more Bam. or less fucked up than mine. It just means... Who's who's better at, at hitchhiking around? This girl. Whoever the hottest one is. That's the, uh, that's the secret. That's right. Gonna, yeah, gonna I know. <laughs> you probably win. You're thinner than me, so... <laughs> I'd, I'd be more willing just to flash my games. Just right off the bat. Yeah, I ain't I would just like, no oh games. no, my car broke down and just, just drop trow and then just start flashing legs. Although... Put underwear on. You know... Flash all the legs. I, I ain't doing that. I ain't... <laughs> I ain't flashing leg. I ain't, I ain't, you I ain't wanna... wearing two different types of fingernail paint. He's fashionable. I, I, I think he was supposed to be, like, I think the, the prompt for this one was really excited. Like, super excited. Uh, the eyes do not reflect that at all. The eyes yeah. reflect a hellish, you know, dissonance <laughs> or something. I don't even know what that is. Like, to me, it's like, it's the, the redness of the pupil combined with the fact that the, the like, blue background, it just, I don't get it. <laughs> I don't get it. It it's, looks like it's, it's a, in shadow, but it's, it's upside not. down star, isn't it? It like it is. Oh, it is borderline oh, oh, Inuyasha. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> yeah. Dee, it's all dee, for dee, you, dee. Damien. I I've just been looking at this and I realized that his one his one canine tooth is here, and then his other canine tooth is yeah, like, coming out like straight hot. out of the middle. It's super hot. Also, uh, <laughs> why does he have just tiny needle teeth all the way back, like a uh, dinosaur? <laughs> Like, why is he a dinosaur? Why doesn't he have doggy ice, iceberg teeth? I don't know what to call them, but I guess they're Dog molars. Bears. Spoon. We always call them iceberg teeth because they look like little little spoon drug teeth. A little spoon drug. Sorry, I don't know what that drug is. If you guys know it's what that heroin. drug is, oh, it's heroin. But don't you inject the heroin? I think it depends on your like, or is it crack? Does crack heat up with a spoon? I'm not sure. It's not really. I should probably I research it. Yeah, because I'm pretty sure heroin you inject into your your bloodstream you to get to heat high. It up, though. Yeah, on a spoon. Maybe it is heroin. I don't know. I thought it was. They had a spoon and then a. Did heater. they have a little tourniquet? I don't. I didn't look. I saw the spoon and the lighter, and I didn't understand. I was like, that looks like drugs. And then I looked away. Yeah, that might just be crack. Just, I just think drugs. that's actually just crack. Oh man, yeah, because I have a certificate of uh, of being dare drug free. Kristen was <laughs> saying that she has three certificates. Two yeah. of them brought to you by Gray Homes. What is yeah, it? Yeah, Gray Graystone Homes or yeah. Graystone. Yeah, it's like basically like my school in California in fifth grade. Like they were very serious about dare. And by the way, I think dare actually makes you do drugs more. But I was a very serious child, and I took it very. I took my uh, my awards very seriously. My dare awards. And it, one of them says tobacco is a drug too. You know, it's a good brought to you by Greystone Homes. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'll, have to, I'll have to take a picture of it. <laughs> so we have hairy penis. Do you like how the hand is like? No, is like jacked up on the wrist there. I like how it looks like the hand uh, like this, and then it's just like completely broken and turned up. Because this is where the the wrist bone yeah. should connect. And they he just like don't. A, he has like a velociraptor hand almost. <laughs> like, you know, like he can only do the. He really does. Like his hand is permanently in like a twist. And it's just, it's just not pleasant to look at that hand. Like. Also look at how, like, look at how long this arm. So you would assume that this arm would go to about here. And then he just has like a, it's a big meaty ass hand. That's a big fucking hand. Like. Well, I mean, like, you don't know how tiny the head is. Like, you know, I mean, like, it, you know, it's hard without the whole body to like. He has like really small shoulders, though. Yeah, he does. And like, but he really also has thick, very triangular thick, shoulders. He has a very thick neck, and it and his neck looks like it just has like multiple tracheas in it and stuff. It just <laughs> like there's just it doesn't there's make any some sense. Some sort of hell beast. And yeah, like the de- and you know what the thing that bothers me is like I know you spent a lot of time. Oh, there's even whiskers on it. I didn't even see that. Which, damn right, I put some whiskers on there. Like, yeah, look like these are supposed to be like the front teeth, and they just like go down uh, the fucking God, side that's of his so face. So gross! Like, and, and like the thing is, is like I know you spent a lot of time on it because I can mouth. tell from the well, no, well the mouth too, but like the fur, the fur detail. Oh yeah, you didn't simplify it in a way that was pleasant. So it just, <laughs> so it's just a lot yeah. of detail, and it's for nothing. It's yeah. just, you know, that's, that's pretty much my my early artistic <laughs> career. A lot of detail for no reason whatsoever. I think it was about this time. I was like, I really need to start doing. More Simplifying. detail. Well, more detail. Oh, more detail. And yeah, it, like, this commission was supposed to be a very, like, no background. 
shown. Um, and then, like, a normal so looking character. There's so many better ways of doing that. But it took me so long just to do the damn, like, fur. Yeah. And this was before I, I sort of figured out that you can sort of, like, go in and... Ah, it has it a bit. Uh, you can start, like, signaling bits of locks out and everything. I think I also have, like, a sort of, like, scratchy... Well, it looks brush. like you used a brush for it. It's just that you didn't do it in a way that... Looks you, nice. you didn't You didn't simplify it. Yeah. Like and, and like some people can do the realistic thing. I personally think that's boring as hell, and I would never do it, which is why I don't. <laughs> I like how so his, I don't, but... his flat X-ray hand. Ugh. You can just like see all he oh, just has God. like big leaves of, of fat between all like... his knuckles. Ugh. Or it he looks, looks like, like crayon, like... like crayons, like sticking out of a box. To me, it looks like a. Oh, God, it almost looks like his hand is metallic because the lighting is just wrong. Like yeah. it's just, it's just gross. And and I guess in the fingernails accentuates the like wrongness of the color. And, like, honestly, like, blue, and the thing is, too, like, blue, red, and then, like, beige or yellow would actually work together really well, but you just didn't quite make it. <laughs> you didn't quite make it. The, 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 it. the ingredients are there for, like, yeah, a good thing. color combination. Like, seriously, the ingredients are there. Yeah. And and you so just close didn't. and so far away. Look at how tiny his eye is, his farther yeah. eye is. Yeah, that's kind of gross. He just, he has, like, a fucking Chuck E. Cheese nose. Like, it looks like it just, like... Just, like, it's gonna go into, like, a most, little... Yeah. He also has the most anime-ass eyes. Like, Jesus. He sure does. Like, like I, the... I've honestly gotten... I've obviously gotten better at doing expression. I mean, but this was not when I was focusing. I was still focusing on, on learning how to draw. Like, for God's <laughs> sakes, cat, Come here! There is no reason for you to be meowing. You are worse than Hitler. Come here. Yeah. Like, the one thing I think you did pretty good is like the ears look like they're fine like on the like they, they look like they're positioned okay kind of yeah i think they're actually positioned fine i mean obviously this far one looks like it's sort of it's, it's, it sort of looks it's, like it's, it's going it's, off the head a little bit but i think it's just because Don't the you suckle him i think the only hey. reason why is because uh you see you see like the the shadow and the i guess the ear on our left this no 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 the the other one <laughs> Yeah, you see, it, I think the only reason it looks like it's falling off is because you inappropriately put shadow right there instead of just leaving it light. Yeah. Because it honestly should just be completely bright. There shouldn't be any shadow right there. Yeah, it should be. So so I think if if you ignore that shadow and you look at the where the ears hit, it's about right. I mean, it's not too bad. Like, yeah. And, that, and that's honestly a thing a lot of people have trouble with. Yeah, is, so is. So at least you could visualize that in 3D, I think, pretty well. Like, that's so. still been something I've been... Congratulations, old Andrea. Yay. You did it. Old or. Am I old, old Andrea, Andrea? Or, or is it, she old Sorry, Andrea. past Andrea. Past Andrea. Okay. There you go. Past Andrea. Congratulations. Like, I think that's, that's been one of the things that I've been having trouble with, is, like, knowing when... Like, because, um... What is it? Less is more, is the saying. Yes. Especially for lighting and oh everything. Like, God, wow, yes. that looks really great on that area. I'm gonna do it all over the goddamn thing. Yeah. And it's not gonna look extremely flat or nothing. And, yeah, I've been guilty of that, too. I've been trying yeah. to cut down on uh, detail and stuff, because you don't really need it. You don't really need it to make get it a pretty here. good illustration. Yeah. So, do you have anything I think else? He just, I think he just wants to get into the cabinet. He wants water. Oh. Does he, he have has, water? He has water. Oh. He wants new water. <laughs> <laughs> and he goes into the bathroom and then he just meows. Yeah. 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 I, I, don't, I think we got the main points. Like, I also like his, uh, his, his dinosaur cheeks. Look at his barrel-ass chest. Do you like his dinosaur cheeks? The, the like, fleshy cheek part? Yeah, 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 I did that for everything for some yeah, time. Yeah, that's hey, over here. That's not how uh, mammals do. That is not how mammals do. <gasps> yeah, that's interesting. Although maybe it wasn't work. how dinosaurs do. We don't know. So, <sighs> oh god, look at this like little turd of a finger here. I yeah. <laughs> look at how this one comes like down, and also what? the nail is facing towards you. Uh, you probably nails. used a reference, but like, I think I might have used myself as a reference. Yeah. Did you not take a picture of it? <laughs> uh, and if you don't have the right lighting, it's kind of hard. I do like how the perfect butt cheek on it's, yeah, uh, it, like, that is, like, a perfect, and, and I just, like, there's no pads, so it doesn't make any sense how we can, like, live. You wouldn't just have, like, a completely furry hand, you know? Like, how awful would that be? Just, is that... just gets gunk and shit in his, just in his hair Oh, all the God, time. can you imagine? You'd just and be, like, like, a sticky two-year-old. I just want to wash my hands. <laughs> you know, yipe, it's just... Yipe, yipe. Yip, yip, yip. I mean, they have Hand fur in between the sound. little patty things, but I don't know. I think we spent some time on this one. We did. I think um, we. Okay, that's anything good. Anything else? Nah, I think I good. think we got it. I I said my piece. 
Huh. We're just about a 30 minutes. Okay. Well, looky, there we go. Look at there, Herschel. Look at there. Look at there. Look at Okay. Uh, so we're, we'll come back with Kristen's then shortly. There we go. That's better. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right. All yeah. right, so it's a uh, it's my what we were talking about before. Uh, yeah. Oh, my painting. There we go. Uh, so uh, let me get off the tumbler here. Yeah. Okay. You ready? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Wow. Yeah. What the? Oh, you went back. There we go. Oh, if you put go in. Sorry, if you go into the plus thing. Okay, so it's definitely two thousand five. So I was in a. Uh, if you say oh five centimeters. If you go the uh, plus, yeah, yeah, there we go. I hate photo bucket. What a piece <laughs> literally of crap. the same size. Let's just do that. Uh so I did this uh, <laughs> with a mouse. That's pretty impressive. Uh, doesn't excuse how bad it is. It's supposed to be a metal dragon that I actually have the figurine, and it is. We had to do a still life, and then I was like, I don't really want to draw anything in the background, so I just drew it in mist. <laughs> And it was really bad. I think the mist might be my favorite, uh, sarcastically, my favorite part about this. Because he just looks like he's in a, he looks like in a really out of focus thing of like, like pulled wool from a sheep. <laughs> it does. It I, was, yeah. Like over a, a, like a shag carpet, maybe. Oh God, it does. Yeah. Uh, I just like how I couldn't render any metal and it just looks to me like. Yeah, it doesn't look like metal. It's it not metal. it looks just pathetic. Like, I don't even know how to like. It looks like. Like, maybe, I would say almost stone, but, like, the, the light isn't... Like, wet stone? Is like, that wet with an H? Or is that... No, like, wet with a, with an E. Okay. Like, little, not, not regular, a wet stone. Regular wet stone. Yeah, a, not a wet stone. I didn't do the white person thing in front, the wet, you know, like... white person thing. Well, sometimes when people, like, when older people say WH words... I literally have wet. never heard that before, that I a have. family guy thing. No, no, people, it, yeah, because the I listened to a podcast and he also pronounces like what like, and it was it's like really weird because he's not that old, and I guess it's just like an accent thing. I would assume maybe it's an like accent, where, accent like thing. Like they would say not like where age thing because everyone in the fifties did it. <laughs> well, where are you going, little girl? You know, it's like that. It's like I who do you know from the fifties that did it? Like no, just like in the fifties movies. Like I've been watching the MST three K. Did they? Yeah. They do. It's really weird. Like you'll hear it. It is just like very weird. Yeah, it's weird. But but yeah, no, it it looks like just it's gross. I hate it. Like this is one of the worst things ever. And I and I spent a lot of time on it. and It's just awful. Yeah, I can I can tell you spent a lot of time on it. It looks like you you went through and you rendered everything, and it was sort of like light. And then you went in with like a heavier brush and just fucked everything. A burn brush. Was it a burn brush? Oh, it yeah. was. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, it was. Yellow and stuff. On the I think this is one of my first uh, forays into. I think it was. I think it was uh, P.S. Paint, which is by Corel Painter. It's by Corel, but it's really bad. It's really bad. Like, even worse than Corel Painter Did you not is. like this one arm yep. over here? That's why, that's why I why think it's... that's one of the reasons why I just started drawing mist. <laughs> like, I know you're going to hate me. It's really not that bad. God damn it. <laughs> well, I'm sorry. Well, that's why I, I also found something in my uh, my folders. Well, no, let, let's keep talking about this. Well, no, like, it's related think... to this. Oh, okay. It, well, it, I think the rendering on this is really not too bad. Like, you you have, like, your designated light areas, and then your your dark areas still have a lot of detail in them. Like, you didn't do the, the lazy thing and just, like, not put any detail in there. Like, what I used to do. <laughs> well, see, the, the problem is, like, I did spend a lot of time on... Th- I don't know. Like, see, that's the problem I'm running into, is that, like... Like it, I, Apparently Kristen had no period where she wasn't good at illustration. No, no, no. It, not, not that it's good. It just shows that I'm putting effort into something. And, mm-hmm. like, I was never really, like, especially lazy about things. Like, I, I tended to be very, really serious about, like, I would draw, like, I was looking at my sketch pages and I'm like, there aren't a lot of funny ones because I'm actually, like, drawing things from photographs and, like, drawing mm-hmm. legs and things. And, As and you hands. should. Yeah, so it was like, well, this isn't fun, but then, but then I found some other things that are pretty good. So there's like a sweet spot when I'm a preteen that's just, mm, it's just like good. all the bad things. But if, that was one of them. If that we was can like, review stuff where you're I thought 13 this one years was old good. drawing and then I am 20 years old drawing, I don't mind it. <laughs> I, <laughs> it's just well, because I've been drawing longer, so yeah, I guess yeah. so that so that's why. But but I thought this was just especially considering how I draw now. This is just completely it's, out of it's the, flat. You know. I mean, but if it's a metal figurine and stuff, then it's... I think I... You still have this, don't you? Yeah, I still have the figurine. Yeah, okay, because I'm like, I swear to God, I've seen that. 
Yeah. Uh, yeah, okay. I'm sorry. I, just, I have other things, now, too, if this, you want to. Is this part of the belly, or is No, this... that's the leg. That's actually, but I think Well, that's... no, it looks like the leg goes actually up here. Yeah, yeah, down. it does. Yeah, no, like, right now, it just looks like it has, like, this big, giant, like, hamstring. <laughs> yeah, if you guys hear, it's cicada time here. Yeah, some loud know. cicadas. There was also an ice cream truck earlier, and we're like, yeah, there's oh, an ice cream what's truck. What's that? What's it? That's just really loud through here. Is it loud? Really? Like, Christ, that's loud. Yeah, it is. So it's Andrea, Kristen, and the cicada. Should should we come up with a name for the cicada? Sid, Sid the cicada. Sid, Sid cicada. Sid cicada. <laughs> Jim Cata. Yeah. Um. Yeah. No. Like, now, if there's not a lot to say about this, I do have others. I mean, well, it's like you, you did some sort of like pillow lighting, and that looks like that really fucked things up. Yeah. Because like without it, it looks like you have a ton of detail, and it looks like you been a long time rendering like yeah like, like see, over here the... stuff there's a lot of really careful meticulous detailing yeah it took shows. me a very long time like i remember distinctly sp- I mean, staying if up you want me to get this. super nitpicky oh, on this back do. tail area the light is coming from the wrong side sure but, is i mean i'm sorry my <laughs> things aren't as amusing it's just i don't know it's it's hard because i didn't work digitally a lot like mm-hmm. i literally worked in ms paint and then i switched once i got a tablet i went instantly to photoshop and because i had been drawing by hand so much like it it wasn't like i i guess the the about the worst thing was is my mouse stage and mm-hmm. like we already did one that was with the mouse the dragon the two people fighting that cave yeah dragon yeah thing. yeah and that's like really about as like the worst, it's that's just, the worst of the Yeah, mystery. like, and that's, you know, and it's unfortunate that I don't have a lot of, like, really juicy things, but a lot of sketches are pretty bad. Like, but I do have said, a lot of... So what's your thing on your phone, then? Uh, which I will it post is, yeah, up I, here. I, I wasn't, I wasn't uh, prepared, so I didn't... I, but basically, what I found was, uh, this was a project where we, you know, we did in, it was in class, and we had to do it at home, which is why I had to use a mouse, which was awful, by the way. Don't ever, ever do that. Just, I, I did. But All what time. we had to do, and you can zoom in and out, we had to try out different filters on it. And I actually, <laughs> and I had, and I thought it was so amusing. That's why I wanted to do this one today, because I actually found is, that last digital, night. Or? Yeah, yeah, this is, yeah, basically, but basically what I did, it's a printout. It's a, it's a laser printout of the, of the different, and it's black and white, of course, but. It's fucking terrible. And you can person. zoom in. I know. I took a picture of it, and it's bad. It's uh. just not very good. So the, uh, let's name the filters. So this is like the the, uh, the color, color pencil. pencil. Oh, yeah. it's, all, it's undoubted. Let, yeah. let, let me oh, sure. let me see yeah. if I can get to that. this color pencil. Uh, Jesus, shit. Uh, this looks like um like the, the sp- like watercolor. Is that what it that might one? be? Yeah, honestly, like the I splattery can't... watercolor thing. Yeah, honestly, like the the laser print is such bad condition, but I found this so amusing. I was like, this is, this is good. Uh, is this like a diffusion layer? <laughs> I think it what is. The That's f- why it's like... Because, like... Yeah, she it, just it asked us like to it's... use different ones, and I think I just used the default without actually adjusting That's them at awful. all. Yeah, it's really bad. I had no idea what I was doing. Also, why were we even learning these? Yeah, Jesus. You don't want to ever teach people just to rely on a yep, fucking... You know this one. Uh, <laughs> Jesus. Half tone. Half tone, but only like the lightest part. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You know, that's, this awful. one might be my favorite because it just, it's just a splotch of halftone. Yeah, it's just like a. You can obviously tell it, it affected the same fucking area because this was too dark for really do anything, and the light area is, I assume, is this. I don't understand shitty why that half-tone. Even happened. Like, why was the threshold just straight up? I didn't just, know what threshold was, and I didn't learn. So, uh, <laughs> mm, oh god, what is this one called? It's like it's it's like cloud diffusion or something, and then like the lens flare. Oh yeah, I, I didn't even look at the. I thought the lens flare was just from the lens flare is actually lens in flare. there. Yeah, it, the lens flare is Jesus. with the cloud one. I think I, I think we had to pick one from each uh, section. Difference clouds. I think. It was oh, so that you one. you went through like we had to do it. We had to go through each category and pick one. Canvas. That, yeah, that's texture. Fucking canvas. Oh Jesus! Like. God, you can't even see any. That is awful. It's bad. I mean, it might have been. And again, this is a laser print, so it might have been. <laughs> I'm not saying anything because I'm just giving Kristen a face. Just oh, fuck you. Oh, oh fuck come you. on, come on. That's so beautiful. Come on. It's like real stained glass. It's like real stained glass combined and with rocks. And also brick. And also some brick and glass. Stone. Yeah, old brick and glass here. Do you like how my name is constantly on it anyway? Like on each one. Like, I didn't even bother to take it off, because I think it was probably one layer. Actually, yeah. it probably was multiple layers, because I'd used layers at that time. I would... 
<laughs> Jesus Christ, that's awful. It's bad. I... Uh, this is... <laughs> this is like the Spooky crack ghost. leak. The, the cracky one. And then it just has like Crack the... lair? Crack lair, there you go. Crack-a-lair. And then it just has like the fucking quilting pattern just on this middle part. Yep. We had to do it. Oh, I don't God. know why. This was our homework. It was to learn the different filters. Now, at a Jesus. scale of one to a million, how bad is that? Well, is a million good or is a million bad? Million is ba- bad. Uh, it would be nine hundred nine thousand. <laughs> Very close. Ninety. To just... <laughs> I look at how it looks like he's wearing like like just really blotchy sunglasses. Like there's just there's just a black. It doesn't actually look like that. It just looks yeah, your awful. Your threshold is just all over the. I didn't know place. what anything was. Oh, and then the last just one takes some. T- Glitter. That is the same fucking <laughs> canvas texture as the first one, and then... Glitter. Gl- glitter. I don't even know what to, to call that. Like, I, don't I don't think know. that's I... even in Photoshop anymore. It basically looks... I was gonna looks... say, I don't even remember that it one. It looks like a, an anime it's love scene. Pointless. Anime love scene filter. Like, it sparkles. <laughs> you enjoy that? I thought I thought that was amazing. That's why I wanted to, to show this one. And I, and I have some other ones, too, if you want to see it. Well, that's the thing. It's like, uh, if we are getting to a point where Kristen... After seven episodes, I, Kristen no longer has no, any bad artwork. It's, it's, it's not I would that. say it's delve just, into your, your preteen shit. I, I lost a lot of the, the original artwork, and I mm. can't actually view a lot of it, unfortunately, because I don't Hack have Windows. Hack into your Gaia online account. I tried. I actually tried. I spent Did an you? hour going into Gaia, and I was like, I cannot read through all these forum posts and look for all this garbage. Like, I do have... All right. I have another one that is pretty... You, is mouse garbage, if you want to see that. And it and it has multiple characters in it and is full color. Okay. So well, let, let's see what our. Yeah, we're only at eleven minutes. Oh yeah. Okay. So pause it real quick and I'll and I'll I'll no, bring no. it up. We're gonna bring all the hilarity. Are you? Just, is it just in? Oh, you're just you're just gonna parse yeah. through my photo. Back up the oh, sorry. You're gonna parse through my photo bucket account. Is it this one. No, that's just a that's just a random scan. I was really into Gundam Seed at the that's time. Sam liked it. No, no, a lot of it is is just they oh uh, please don't look at that. That one's so bad. It also has a shaded version oh. over there. You can see it in the bottom. There you go. Oh <laughs> I think this will be just okay, fine. Okay, alright, there you go. This'll be fine then. I didn't think it was interesting enough, but there you go. Well, I mean that's the thing. Like my mom listened to one of our episodes and she's like, I was waiting for more of your crappy artwork. How come you're just doing one? I'm like, can't bleed the well dry so quickly, but yeah, yeah I think it's it's perfectly fine if we just sort of Yeah, for my new it, it's and... easier. Well it's just because I did a lot more sketches and small things when I was at this age. I yeah. didn't do big I didn't do big things because I just So is it Sephiroth? Uh it is Sephiroth because <laughs> uh because Look at his Final nose. Fantasy VII. Yeah, Look you at his like that? Nose. You like that? Just rams straight into Oh Do you like how I use the pen tool to to do the lines because gotcha, I have a mouse? I couldn't tell. Yeah. Isn't it bad? Isn't it? I just like his his really digital eye. His like fucking three D render eye. eye. Yeah. Now is he the one eyed angel? <laughs> or oh, uh, I. Why are we always going back to Sephiroth? I really liked Final Fantasy VII when I was younger. Like you have no idea. You liked his sultry, drunken haze. <laughs> it's just like uh, no, because he was a badass. Because he killed people, and I was like, a, I was a teenager, so I was like, wow, that's so cool. Gonna steal them wings. <laughs> you know what's weird? Why did they call him One Winged Angel when he had six leg wings and then one arm wing? I don't like, fucking know. I don't know. That's my question to all of y'all. <laughs> Yeah, our question to you. Why is he not What's a seven wings angel? What's the deal with Sephiroth? Not being... <laughs> Save for Sephiroth, that form. Why does he have seven wings? His ear is also super high up. It is. I his not... ear is literally on the level as his eye. It is. It's... I am, like, actually nauseous looking at this. Good, because, good. Uh, That's the feeling we want to invoke. Yeah. It's, it's straight up nauseousness. It's just, it's just bad. Like, the shading is just kind of like a gradient, and I can tell it isn't supposed to be. That one was painted in open canvas, I believe. Yeah. Uh, and that's a Windows only program. And that's one of the reasons why I can't open a lot of my old artwork is because I literally cannot because. So Mac. where's your. Actually, let me get a. Go to the library view. Well, let me let me save this. Oh, okay, good. Save that. Save initial... Save that garbage. Uh, it's just. It, yeah, see, the pro- I guess the well, problem well, is, yeah, I just didn't have a lot of. Did you like... get rid of the JPEG thing? You just. Uh, no, it, you just. Basically, when it saves. Just, just no, no, don't, don't do that. Don't do that. Windows will not forgive you. Just save oh, it. I know. 
Just save it. It'll be fine. All you have to do is just right click on it and then just edit it after the fact. It'll be fine. You you edit, just if you if you just uh, so rename, rename it, rename it, and then just remove the extra JPEG crap on the end, and it's perfectly fine. I don't know why your computer does that. Also, photo bucket is garbage. Oh, it might become unstable. It's we fine. Might, well, there it is. It might actually Clearly. just be fine. <laughs> it might just be fucking. That's what I hate about. Perfect. I I don't know. Like, all right. So, where's your? You have oh, to I can buy this as a framed. Print you should for buy 20. it as a canvas wrap. Let's do it. Let's go in there. How much is a? Does a? I'm surprised. Forty six dollars. How come they're allowed to buy? How come photo bucket allows people to buy prints well, of my don't. artwork without? Yeah, you know, see that's that's what I hate about photo bucket. bucket. It's but also this is a private photo bucket, so private okay. bucket. Yeah, private Where bucket. Is Where's what? Where's the the one you want to show me? Oh well, you have to go. I don't know. Like I, I you have to go to the library Your view. Bucket. There you go. Well, see now it's too too early. See that's the problem is Just that. Just go to one hundred and nine. Okay. Oh, you want the you want the vampire chicken? It's right there. The sun. Yeah. It's not really bad, but it it was drawn in MS Paint, and I figured you find it amusing. It's just, it, I was quirky as a kid. <laughs> One of my characters was a chicken that was also a vampire. Why? Because I was fucking 13. <laughs> I want to redraw him, but I want to make my him a hyper realistic chicken. My characters are also chicken. just myself, but with dragon wings. And she escaped from a, a laboratory and she had no memory. Yeah, that's true. So <laughs> my vampire chicken could actually get along pretty well. I was a very quirky teenager, and I really want to redraw Is this. Is 13 really a teenager? And I know it's a teen in it. I was also adult sized at twelve or eleven, <laughs> so I would say it's I was perfectly fine as a teenager. So you did this at thirteen? Um Yeah, about thirteen or fourteen. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> I had been drawing since I was two and I used MS Paint all the time. Did you know if you use MS Paint, you can actually uh le- left click what is the one in Windows where you're the opposite clicker? Like the normal <laughs> one is left click, right? Right click. Right click is the normal one? No, left click is the normal one. Okay, well, if you basically have different, if you have the, uh, you can actually right click, and it'll, it'll, like, only isolate the color in the left click area, and you can basically draw shadows and stuff, so, like, the way I did, like, the red was, I had the lighter red in, like, the left click. It was really cool, like, it actually was, like, I, like, completely broke down that program, and I can use it, like, to a T. And then I use Max now, so now I don't have that. So but. was this chicken crucified, or...? No, he's just super badass. <laughs> and he, Why uh, is he standing on a cross? Because he's a vampire, and I like Castlevania, and but I also liked Vampire why is he stand- I'm I'm going to take this as you're some sort of satanic chickenkin. Chickenkin. <laughs> chickenkin. <laughs> um, and you really just, like, you, you want to lord over our lord, Jesus Christ. So you don't like my chicken character, Andrea? Chicken. How, so 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 when you when you looked at it, what was your first reaction? Were you just upset? <laughs> yeah, I was. I was upset. I'm like, you drew this when you were thirteen. It was bullshit. I could have been fourteen. Oh well, no, that's okay. <laughs> here, you want to see? Here, click on the fish one too. That one's pretty let bad. Me, let me Are you still? <laughs> Let's. Oh, uh, that one was pretty bad. But you say this, fucking thirteen years old. Sorry, let me. I have to sorry, all I see of these. Apparently, apparently, I'm not even having. To, I'm sorry, and it's it's not like they're you know. I think they're bad, but vamp chicken. That is I an really want to repaint that one though. I really do. I think that would be really fun. I want a hyper realistic chicken, but in a cloak, but also has fangs. <laughs> and Listen, it's like one of those pretty whatever. silky black chickens. Like you know, ah, oh, that would be beautiful. Any sparkles in all the right, daylight? Let's go to your, your fish one. Yep, you like how I copy and pasted fish, but see, then change the color on one. Yeah. And also the colors were MS Paint colors because I was using MS Paint. <laughs> How old were you when you did this one? The same age. Mm. It's like see, like what I'm seeing is uh, you went straight to doing stylized stuff, which hides the fact that you don't know how to like draw yeah. certain things. So you played your strengths, which I mean, like good on you, Kristen. But <laughs> um. Yeah, like I, I see a lot of mimicking from from anime and manga. oh yeah, oh yeah. I, I that that is why I consider this my dark age because anime really influ- influenced me, and not necessarily in the best way. Although I think I was okay at drawing animals because I did I did draw from like photographs and stuff a lot. And also, mm. fish aren't exactly the most complicated shapes. You say that I could find something for me being thirteen year old trying to draw a goddamn fish, and it's terrible. <laughs> well. 
it is simplified. So these aren't realistic, and I guess that takes a lot of the, like, tooth. Yeah. You know, which does. is unfortunate. Although, you like how the stars are in front of the moon? Because I fucking do. That's I, I thought he was eating the one star. No, he's just floating past it. Also, there's the gold shiny one. He's is that there. the rare Pokemon? It's the rare Pokemon, yeah. It's just... <laughs> I just really hate the colors because it's so MS Paint. Like, I'm having, like, a like a floppy flashback where I had to save these to floppies. Oh, I was going to say, a floppy fl- Uh I should really one them, find some... One of, them, one of them wrecked flashbacks I've been having. Like, like I, had, I had this really <laughs> awesome... I was really into the ocean as a kid. Like, fish and stuff just in the ocean. Thrown, just thrown right into the ocean. <laughs> Well, I had, like, this MS Paint file, and it was, like, 3.2 megabytes, which is huge for Windows 95. Like, and it was way too big for a floppy, and I was sad because the the computer crashed. But I managed to save an Aerodactyl fan art on one of my floppy disks. I'll have to see if I can actually get get it off because it's it's bad. Like, it is, like, brown and then dark blue. You keep saying this, but... Okay, I'm sorry. It's probably good for, like, an 8-year-old, but it's hilarious. Probably. You know, so, okay, so... Yeah, no, I had a lot of my problems with stylizing, and also the internet didn't exist, like, at this point. Well, the internet existed, but I wasn't posting online, so I didn't get any feedback, the internet, which is probably it why just I was took, more confident. It just took ten minutes to bring up any sort of photo. Yeah. <laughs> and so, everything was on Elfwood. Oh my, oh god. <laughs> Ugh. I got turned down for Elfwood. Really? Oh yeah. I was on Elfwood, and then I uh, got I, a death I threat was on <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, I know. So basically, I was like, I feel really uncomfortable being on Elfwood, but I can't delete my account. Can you please delete my account? So that's the reason why I don't have an Elfwood. Jesus. Is because uh, someone says, I'm going to I'm gonna find out where you are and kill you. And I had no why? idea. No, it was just out of the blue. So it was probably just a troll. I had never met this person. I had no idea who they were, and I tried to find out. And they actually looked into the IP address, but apparently they had gone through the proxies um. so they could find out. And that person was pretty smart for 2000s days. Going through the proxies, but you were yeah. you talking to the original hacker. Nothing of value was lost. <laughs> like I, I remember submitting good. some of my my early stuff, which is some of the really shitty stuff that we've been seeing, and yeah, I was turned down. I said my artwork was not to par. And they turned me down. They they used to do that. They used to. I hated it because it took like two weeks to get something approved. It wasn't worth going on. Mm. You know, so basically, like you'd be like, oh man, I drew this sweet new thing. And then I'd try to post it, and it would take, like, two weeks. They approved of everything? Uh, I don't remember, honestly. And Hmm. I really don't. I I thought it was just just an approval just to get on the site so you could post. You had to... Because that was, like, the main art site besides DeviantArt. They they did that, but then they also moderated every single piece of artwork that was posted on that site. Mm. And, and, you know, and it's like the... You know... I don't know. (laughs) But he also had just started drawing. Yeah. I've been drawing for. I, like I was a right at the as I, as I said in the beginning. I, I had all the the Dunning Kruger going on, and I'm like, this stuff, top notch, better than professional <laughs> illustrators. Sure, she has a big gaping open mouth, and her legs are <laughs> tiny. Bitches don't know what they're talking about. I was really you. You were way more ambitious with your drawings than I ever was, though. Mm-hmm. Like none of these drawings are ambitious. I would say they're they're not ambitious. There's not really a lot going on. They're very flat. Come here. You know, the colors are just awful. Like, well, but MS Paint, I mean... No, you know what? You can do use MS Paint and do fantastic yeah, things. I've seen I good just, stuff on MS Paint yeah, before. Yeah, usually pixel art. And, uh, yeah, it tends to be pixel art. Yeah, but, you know, like, I was not ambitious. I would usually draw one character, and a lot of times it would just be a face. Yeah. And it wasn't, like, terrible or anything. It wasn't especially bad. There wasn't anything, like, you know, it wasn't hilarious. Well, like, I'm looking but at this... Oh, that one was bad. That was we by could the say way, that for a different time. That actually. was yeah. Actually, let's do because that was a that was one of my uh, college. That was one of my AP art submissions. Good. Believe it or not. So there you I go. We'll say that for another time. Um, yeah. Did we want to? If we are getting to that point where we're sort of running down on the amount of artwork that you have, do we want to start uh, opening ex, uh, ap, ap, not applications, uh, submissions from people for us to critique their artwork? Yeah. Are you ready for yeah, that? Yeah, no, that would that? that would be good. And it's like and it, and I feel terrible cuz like I really was looking. I I basically stayed stayed I did like 2 hours of searching through my <laughs> box. And like I did find some sketches and stuff that were pretty good, but mostly it shows how like I was a pretty, pretty imaginative 6-year-old and 7-year-old and mm-hmm. a lot of the stuff was from when I was like 2. And it like it, it's still like you know, and it's not that I was I was good. It's just that I really liked drawing, and I did it all the time. And you could sh- you could see that my hand, and it, it seemed to me like 
I wasn't good at drawing, but I had really a really steady hand. Like I developed like a good good muscles, mm. I guess. So hand eye coordination. Yeah. Mm. So and I had that from a young age, and it doesn't mean that my handwriting was good or anything. But you save this fish one. Save a fish. Talk about literally all the fucking. Things. I'm sorry. I, it's you know, okay. Yeah, I do have some funny sketches, and I do have some comics from fish when sky. I was a, like a teenager that are pretty fun. But fishsky.jp yeah. original. Like, like, one of the things I wanted to do was take older artwork that isn't necessarily, like, the worst goddamn thing, but could be made so much better and so much more ambition and push it. And mm-hmm. I, that's one of, the re- one of the things I wanted to do with this, because I think what I suffered from when I was younger, and what I think a lot of people suffer from, is just mediocrity. Like, they're just not... Like, I was just not good, and I didn't know how to push myself any further. Well, a lot of the times people latch on to something that they feel they did well, and then they, they're very tentative to stray away from that. Yeah. And it's that sort yeah. of stagnation if you just draw the same... For me, it was the same dragon face doing the exact same thing all the goddamn time that you don't grow from that at all. And the only yeah. way that you actually do learn and grow is if you push yourself, and it sucks, and you're about to go, you want to, oh, I want to draw something that's going to instantly look nice. But if you push yourself and you force your brain to think about it, then that's actually when you start learning things. Yeah, yeah, for sure. And like, yeah, a lot of the people, they're like, oh, I, I can only draw this character, and it's like the same three, three-quarter profile, you yeah, know. And they don't go outside or try to draw anything. Like, like I actually, like it, like in California, I remember uh, feeding the pigeons in my parents' yard, mm-hmm. so I could do, do still lifes. I didn't know that's what it was called at the time, but, you know, I wanted to draw pigeons, and the internet didn't work. Yeah. So you have to go outside and do it. And a lot of people just don't realize that you can get good just by just drawing a lot. You know, we're coming up to the thirty minute mark. Okay, there we go. Yeah, sorry, sorry that uh, sorry. Just <laughs> so we're gonna. I just, I feel so like at I this point, if you guys and I'll, I'll see if I can put this on screen because I'm still new on putting like notes and shit. Uh, I'll also put it in the description. If you want to send your artwork, or if you, I was gonna say a friend's artwork. Don't send a friend's artwork. Just send like somebody who you have the direct permission of to us, and we will tear it to shreds, and we will be just as 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 critical on it as we have been with our own pieces, but we will make it more of a less of a oh like because a lot of our like, stuff we'll say we don't what really... you did right, and we'll definitely say what you did wrong too. And we'll well yeah yeah I'm, I'm just saying like if like a lot of our own stuff we we know what we did wrong, and that's yeah. why we're pointing it out. We don't know like but I think you did good on this because like we we can see that, but I mean yeah. we we have those feelings inside of us. We can yeah. share that with us with you guys as well. I mean we're not just trying to be gigantic assholes you know? yeah we'll but, make it we'll make it funny but you know we'll yeah, we also will tear you... your stuff to shreds though. yeah and so we, if you are yeah. if you want your stuff put through a, a rigorous critique then we'll do that yeah we won't be unfair though like yeah. i don't think i don't think we're unfair i but will we laugh are at very your critical. if you have the same ball sack hands <laughs> like mine did though i mean if you got ball sack hands i'm gonna laugh at it yeah and like if... we're not gonna hold back so uh, we'll we'll just put that as a disclaimer. Is like really only send stuff that you are are willing to have completely ripped to shreds. Don't yeah. send us something that you think is really good, so you can be disappointed. Yeah, <laughs> like, unless you just we want don't... A, unless you want a critique, and yeah. we will give you a critique. Like, right, we're not, you know, we are good. Luckily enough, with with constructive criticism. Right, but a lot of the stuff we do, I mean, we already we already uh, you know. Did our did our time in the art mines? So you know we we already know that the way we get better is we draw a lot and and we know we're better from what, you know what we were before. And you can too. Anyone can. It just takes time and work. That's yeah. it. That's literally it. That's all it takes. But yeah, I mean, even if you just want to send us some of your really old stuff that you know is crappy and you want to Especially listen to anime. us, anime. Yeah, <laughs> and, and anime. you want us to just laugh at it. <laughs> Goodness, yeah. can we like, ever. We'll, we'll find things to talk about. Oh, yeah. And, you know, you can also say, maybe it'd be good for them to say, oh, just rip this apart. Or if they actually want a, criti- a critique, too, we can we can tack that on. Or we can just do it both. Yeah, it doesn't really but matter. If like, you're interested in sending it, you can send your your stuff to uh, fridgeartpodcast at gmail.com. Uh, like our name of our YouTube, Fridge Art, and then podcast. There's no ha- hamper sands, no teal days. Hamper and, sands. It's where you do your and, laundry. <laughs> Throw it in the hamper sand. <laughs> Do your laundry in the hamper. Oh, I guess so. Um, but yeah, that's just fridgeartpodcast at gmail.com and stuff. And I've never actually checked and see if that email has anything in it. I just had to set up something else for this one. You can set it to, to send automatically, like things automatically to your own Gmail account. Like forwarding. That's what I do with all my alternate things. 
And then I just check mm-hmm. in my uh, computer, like, which one it came from, so I don't accidentally send them, if it's it from an email I don't want them to know about. Yeah, we can always just so. start sub- subbing some of that stuff out. Yeah, like, and it's... If and you're it, okay with that. Yeah, no, I'm totally fine. Like, yeah. I have I have sketches and stuff to show, but it's just not... Like, I have some pieces that I'm still trying to find, and I will find eventually some good ones, but it is very hard for me like, to find. Because, like, my shit folder is plentiful. Yeah, you actually were very ambitious, and like, and well, I really like, admire can... that about your old artwork. Like, I literally just did black and white sketches. I didn't have shit. I'm gonna create a new <laughs> folder, and it's gonna be old shit. So stuff we've already so that goes in there. Da, da, da. Uh, yeah, there's, some, there. there's some good stuff in there. Old see the camp. She goes in there. That's the one for my grandmother. I did again. Uh, we won't get into that until I see a haunting face, and I really hope you get to that one eventually. Which one? The the bottom, bottom this row. One? Yeah, that I was tempted to do that one. Pale, today. pale cocaine face. I mean, that is like powder, powder white skin. But, I mean, but yeah, there's one thing I'm about. It's pale cocaine face. Yeah, uh, and like, this and I feel like, yeah. you know, and like I think. Like, that was, like, the, if, if I had to look at my gallery from, from, you know, 2006 go. to 2008, I would just say the biggest thing was I wasn't ambitious. You just weren't, you weren't completing was, things. Yeah, I, I did a lot of incomplete stuff. Like, most of my stuff in my folder is incomplete, which is so bad, because sometimes it was, like, 80% done. And I'm like, well, this is hard to use, because it's literally incomplete. Yeah. And that was my problem. Like, I, I, I was unambitious. I didn't really... I drew a lot, but I didn't finish a lot of things, so at least I drew a lot, but again, it's not as funny in the future, and I really regret it, because now I don't have as much shit to talk about, about, you know. I was like, I wasn't really doing it at the time for comedy, like, yeah, I I can't wait to laugh at this when I'm older, I was just just like, it was just like a little tally in my book of failures, just again and again. I just regret it, although I do have a lot of great clown pictures from when I was two, and it's not like... I would rather we save the clown pictures for Christmas. Oh, that would be good. We'll, we'll review they're, some, some they're handwritten, terrifying. hand-drawn stories. Uh, t- one is titled, uh, Kitty and His Kittens. Um, <laughs> one is titled, My Trip to the Hospital, which is about when I got mauled by a dog. And it looks like the dog is emitting sausages out of its face. <laughs> it's supposed to be blood. Did you, did you ever draw fan art of Beanie Babies? Because I oh, sure did. fuck no. I did. I may have tried. <laughs> I drew a lot of ones of the bears, and I have, like, bear, like, Beanie Baby Bear Is it bear Princess Diana Bear? Uh, there was. Yeah. Uh, I have a full-color picture of Glory Bear, which is Glory the American... Glory Bear! I was a very patriotic young kid. And so, so those are the kind of things that are at least funny from, like... And, like, the thing is, though, I was, like, eight, but they're still really funny because they're stupid and they're Beanie Babies, yeah, and it's hilarious. Goes to the and I would laugh at an eight-year-old. I would laugh at myself, because I'd be like, what the hell are you doing drawing Beanie Babies? That shit isn't going to be worth we might, anything. We might do the stuff future. if people send us anything. We might title that something. Yeah. Akin to it, like Fridge Art Plus. <laughs> you see, you, you suggested fridge that art, before. Fridge Art, uh, uh, fridge art Prime. I think you also art. suggested that. Mini fr- <laughs> like Mini Fridge or something. Mini Fridge? Oh, that's cute. I like it. Oh, Mini Fridge. We're going to have a Mini Fridge, and it's going to have a harsh critique inside of it. Yeah. Yeah, you you left that in the fridge way too long, and you're gonna have to deal with the consequences. <laughs> That's your fridge because it's there way too. Or it's two months uh, past the expiration, and it's milk. <laughs> also, the milk is symbolic of your artwork. <laughs> spoiled milk. Maybe it could just be that spoiled milk. Maybe it'll be spoiled milk. Spoiled. Did you ever did you ever think when you were younger that you were gonna talk on a YouTube channel? I didn't know what anything was. And it was gonna be called fridge art. <laughs> no, when like, I was six years old, I was really preoccupied with beanie babies and being in You Japan. do have that <laughs> you do have that large like wall poster of like beanie baby stickers on like a, a she fake found background. My, she found the thing my mom laminated for me and it was literally my beanie baby poster. It's, it how wide is that poster? It it's is like three feet wide by three five feet, feet long. Oh my it is God. huge. It's it like is the, absolutely gigantic. It's like the things we have at work are that exact dimension. Like, it's five pretty, feet long. I, it's, it's maybe it's like two and a half by four feet. It is big, but it's essentially a large. Like, was that supposed to be for Beanie Babies? Yeah, was it was. A, it was sort of environment poster. No, no, no. It was a. It was a. I, it came with all the Beanie Baby stickers at the time. So, like, like basically, like it's the third generation sparky. and below. 
It's got yeah. Speedy the Turtle. So I put all the ones I had, and then I put them in the correct zones, like the ostrich and you the planes, did. You and did. the polar bear and the penguin together for some reason, because I didn't They're know friends. any better. They're friends. Also, there's only one, like, Arctic area. You're not going to put the penguin in a goddamn, like, mountain. It'd be sweet. Could be a South American penguins. penguin. They exist. They're not in the mountains. Could be. <laughs> But yeah, so you could tell I was really into Beanie Babies, and it was hilarious. I, I just, when I was younger, whenever I imagined my future self, she was always 17 years old, and she was wearing a business suit. <laughs> like a power suit. <laughs> oh, God, with the shoulder pads? No, not with the shoulder, like it wasn't. That's a power was, suit, right? Yeah, I think the one that is the one powerful. that car, it was just like, I just assumed that when I was 17 years old, I was a full-grown adult, and that you just had to wear a suit all the time. And look at me, I'm, oh. I'm 28, and I'm wearing <laughs> younger clothes than I did when... I imagined mm-hmm. I would be really beautiful at 16, and I would automatically know how to do my hair and <laughs> do my fingernails and I stuff. I also had that same thing. I'm and like, my hair is going to be I immaculate. never learned. I never learned how to do any of that, and I ended There's up no being a frumpy, point. like, <laughs> just a frumpy. frumpy. No, 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 not now. I'm talking about when I was 16. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. that picture, you're kind of frumpy. Oh, I am incredibly frumpy, and I even have pictures to prove it because the the, the Amer- I, I we had we went to a photo booth I guess after nine eleven, and everything was America themed because nine eleven nine eleven nine eleven, and uh, <laughs> and it was funny because it's just like a sixteen square or like twenty four. It's a lot of pictures, and it's just me looking terrible with my two cute younger sisters, but then American flags everywhere, and it's like it's a it's a. I laughed because it was a it was the time. It was the times, and it, it's just I, I laugh at I, my grandfather in Wisconsin. He still has that, that meme picture, and it's literally just a print-up from an email of that crying American eagle in front of the 9 <laughs> And he has it framed in a nice oh little frame, God. and I, every time I go back, I'm like, oh! <laughs> and it's terrible, because oh like, trust me, I was really affected by 9-11, and it, meant, it means a lot to my yeah, family. Yeah, her, her father was in the Pentagon. Yeah, he didn't die. The plane came into it. But he literally, right after that, like, the, the cell phone towers went down. I was in seventh grade. We heard about it on the radio and it was horrifying because then we did I didn't hear from my dad the entire day I know and yeah do you and think was, this is a good time to bring up 9-11 probably not but... as we are already way over in time <laughs> sorry I have a lot but of feels t- t- <laughs> feels about 9-11 TLDR 9-11 you know. was bad yeah TLDR uh no don't no 9-11 is allowed. yeah sorry yeah and also it's very US centric but we are also Americans so you know Honestly, like, uh, the the analytics and stuff through Google is, like, we have three Russian viewers. Yeah, Um, so don't say anything bad about Putin. Or, like, well, honestly, though, Russians that are using the internet are probably, like, I don't know. I would consider them normal human beings, like you and I. Oh, yeah, no. Just people and the Oh, they are. Russians. Anyways, so. Spread communism, I'm scared. I know you are. I know you're scared of communism. (laughs) But if we give everyone free health care, then. (laughs) <laughs> you know, no, I'm I'm fine. I'm 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 quite liberal. But anyways, it's just fun. so <laughs> so this has been fridge art, and that probably the the fucking thing has probably been up for forever. Um, but yeah, so thank you for joining us, for fridge art. Um, yeah, thank you. I've been Andrew Ravik, and I've been Kristen Plesko. And uh, do we have any sort of musical number? Today? Uh, I have a screwdriver and a thing of Liquitex, and I'm just gonna make choppy sounds. We take pictures that we did and then we yell at them. <laughs> and I need to use one hand to actually turn off. Fridge. Oh my god. <laughs> Perfect. Bye.